What's up, MJ Smooth back with some more Legacy of Goku 2. Last episode, we were playing as future trunks, or past trunks, whatever it was, kind of trunks. And, uh, maybe we turned to Super Saiyan, now we're Gohan. We had to go get our math book because our mama freaking told us to because she is, uh... Hey, mom. Hey. Did you find your math book yet? How are you going to win the brief prize for achievement in science without studying your math? Alright, let's just go ahead and get, get our math. And look, if I don't even go get my math, if I just want to go outside. I don't think so, young man. No playing until you've done your work. Jeez. Alright. Uh, when I'm doing uh, the gameplay, or when I'm, eh, yeah, can't even talk. There's not a math book. While I'm playing, I'm going to probably do some, I don't know how to pick up things. I'm going to probably go ahead and speak, like, my, my all the Dragon Ball Z characters for you guys, so. Bear with me. I mean, I'm not the best one, but I, I can do lots of them. So. Now we got our math book. Let's go ahead and study. I'll give you one of my Gohan voices. I guess I'll just do my math for a while. Ugh. That's the best I can give. I'm gonna try. I don't remember opening the window. This looks like my chance to get outside for a while. Yay! <laughs> and look at this. Now we have a safe spot. We can go ahead and just save here. Sweet. Now we're just gonna run over here. You also have the ability to run fast. I was just doing that. I know how to run faster. God. This is the number thing that will make me, uh, that tells me what my power level is, or what level I am. It's a barrier. I'm stupid. But, uh, yeah, they're all different colors, because it represents, uh, either orange for Goku, purple for, I think that's for Piccolo, uh, no, no, purples? Yeah, yeah, okay, yeah. And light blue for Gohan, dark blue for Vegeta, uh, oh wait, no, no, purple's for Trunks. Uh, I don't know. Anyway, let's go. Let's continue on. It's a nice little place. Hello? Oh, hi, Gohan. Dad? Is it really you? Of course it is. Dad, it really is you. I can't believe you're back. I miss you so much. I miss you too, son. What happened up there on Namek, Dad? What happened to Frieza? Ellipses. You can tell me what happened, can't you, Dad? Uh... Dad? <laughs> Your dad isn't coming back. He's a loser. Nothing but a loser. No, no, no! Oh, snap! What? What? One punch. Come on, it's a cheat look. Wow. Oh, what the heck? I think I broke the game. I broke the game. Heh. <laughs> that was weird. I'll tell you why it looks like that I'll t in just a minute. Whoa, what a crazy dream. Could it mean that Freeze is back? I can sense him. But how can that be? Ring. Ring. The phone. The phone is ringing on the living room. Okay, here's the reason why uh, I leveled up so quickly just like that. It's because I'm trying to get through the entire game perfectly. So, I don't want to mess up anything. So, yeah. It's the phone. Maybe I should see who it is. Obviously. Oh. Ow. <laughs> Hello? Go on. Are you feeling what I'm feeling? Yeah, Krillin, but who is it? It can't be you-know-who, can it? Voldemort's back. I'm just kidding. I'm afraid so. I can smell him. I'll never forget that stench. He had a, he had a smell? I just can't figure it out. I thought for sure my dad finished Frieza once and for all. So did I, but it looks like we were wrong this time. The rest of us are meeting up to make a plan. We probably won't be able to defeat Frieza, but we at, but we at least have to try. I'll meet up with you, but I first need to get my sand battle armor. I hid it in a cave so my mom won't find it. <laughs> Smart. That's probably a good idea. We need we need any advantage we can get. Journal update. Let's go. She never suspected a thing. All right. Save. 
We're gonna go off to that barrier with level two. Ow. A barrier. Stop it! There we go. Hang it Alright! You found the sand battle armor. Alright, look I'm a bait. A bait. A bait. I don't like to cuss. So be like, a bait. So you'll hear me just say, a bait. With the AU sound. Okay. Ahead is a world map sign. You can fly high above the ground and blah, 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 blah. Plus A button to get it. Alright. We're flying. Fly on the wings of love. Fly. Beautiful. Northern Wastelands. Let's go. Alright. Oh, shoot. Nice. Big key. Shoot. Get off me, son. Get back off. That's strange. Those robots look like part of the old Red Ribbon Army my dad told me about. I was about to say, how does he know about that? You weren't... Tiger, move away. Back off. Back off. I achieved level three. I try to make sure I don't die from anything, so... Yeah. Back off. <laughs> I'm a boss. It's just aimed at freaking. Thank you. Ow. Stupid. Tiger. I'm not gonna get bodied like you guys. By you guys. Not like you guys. Here we go. Here's some chicken. Stop it. Stop. Thank you. Just wanna kill you and devour your items that you give me. Let's go. Hey. Hey, bro, we better see some action. I don't mean to alarm you, but I'm detecting two energies headed this way, and both of them feel like Frieza. I never felt anything any anywhere close to the amount of power I'm sensing right now, and I have a feeling this is only the tip of the iceberg. Oh, Tian, you three-eyed punk. <laughs> I'm scared! Aren't you afraid, Gohan? No, because you're a pansy. I, I, I'm not. I'm a boss. <laughs> All right. I got strength one, capsule endurance, blah, blah, blah. Stamina, piece of crap. I came here to see Frieza, but Yamcha's mad at me. Do you realize what Frieza will do when he finds you here? Of course I do. He'll come down and blow up the planet, but I want to see him before he does. What's wrong with that? Besides, I hear he's kind of cute. I'm amazed. It's amazing how every time you open your mouth, you prove you're an idiot. That's the stupidest impression of Bulma I've ever done. Vegeta is so unpredictable, it's hard to tell what, it's mo what his motives are. He's done terrible things, but I guess I should be forgiving. That's what Goku would do, right? Oh my god. I'm not ready. I'm not ready. I can't. I can't play the Frieza! What I have to say to I'm sorry, I can't do it. It's so, ah! But Vegeta, I can do this. It's perfect. Sue, Kakarot failed after all. Frieza's still alive, and he's coming here. How do you know? Maybe it could be someone else. I know! I'm making my business to know, unlike you. Hey, what's that supposed to mean? If you guys do not understand what Vegeta's talking about, um, let's just say uh, Vegeta knows that there is something between, uh, well, not between, but let's just say Vegeta right here and Boma have a little thing going on. Um, Yamcha... It's just too stupid to understand what's really going on, so... Anyway, forget it. Alright, is everyone here? Good. Just over that ridge to the north is a place where Frieza will be touching down. Are you sure, Vegeta? Yes, I'm sure. Now zip it! Shut up! I don't want him to know we're waiting. As soon as you're ready to fight Frieza, head over the ridge. I won't mind since... I won't, mi I won't mince words here. Odds are, without Goku here, none of us will survive fighting Frieza. But we have to try. Nice thinking, Piccolo. That's why I like you. Unless we stop Frieza right here and now, we might as well kiss the entire planet goodbye. I don't want to kiss the fight. I'll kiss it. Okay, I kissed it. <laughs> Let's go. Let's go. Whoa. Earthquake! Earthquake! Er earthquake! Yeah! 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 Everybody just reacts differently. <clears throat> Here we go, some freezing voice. So, this is Earth. How quaint. I forgot how King Cold's voice sounded. My bad. 
Yes, how very quaint. It's fitting that the Saiyans should call such a puny planet home. Honestly, Frieza, we could have finished this simply by destroying this planet from, from space. Father, that would spoil all the fun. I plan to savor my revenge. Every little bit. <laughs> it's his fault that I have this cybernetic body. He humul- he humul- Oh my god. He humiliated me. When Goku returns home, he will find everything he has ever known or loved in ruined that stupid monkey! He will know the wrath of Frieza! Not that I don't just love it here. But I still don't see why we can't simply destroy this pathetic mud bulb right now. Allow oh, crap. Allow me to demonstrate by vaporizing all the Saiyan's friends one by one. And my, oh my! That sounded like Babadeep. I'm sorry. I didn't mean to do that. Won't he be surprised when he returns home and finds no, over no one here to welcome him? Except me! <laughs> Soldiers! Hup, 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 hup! Left, right, left, right! One, two! Let's all split it evenly. Two blues on one side, two greens on one side. All right. <laughs> I want you to begin your search for the Saiyan's pathetic friends. And when you find them, show no mercy. Yes, sir. What the heck? Not so fast. You must be Frieza. I've been waiting a long time to meet you face to face. We have a guess. Now I'm going to destroy you. Ooh, we better run. Isn't that right, Father? <laughs> Ew. You don't know what you're up against, boy. I know exactly what I'm up against, Frieza. And let me tell you, I'm not worried. Just look at my face on the screen. Look at my beautiful freaking face. Yeah. Make no mistake, I'm going to finish you off once and for all. Who is this guy? His power level is huge. His power level makes Frieza seem like nothing. Incredible. I've never sensed anything like this before. Where would someone with this m kind of power have come from? If nothing else, I'd say this little creature is quite the comedian. Enough joking around. You two are about to find out what it's like to fight a real Super Saiyan. And I'm not talking about Goku. He's not the only one, you know. I can be one too. What? Ha! You cracked me up, kid! <laughs> ah! Boss. It's impossible! So this is a Super Saiyan. And now I'm going to get rid of your friends just like this. Bop, dust, bop, dust, zap, dust, zap, zap, dust. For you, Frieza, slice! <laughs> Dust. <laughs> Frieza! Super Saiyan, I'm impressed. To encounter a fighter of your caliber is a rare occurrence indeed. You see, I can appreciate a great talent such as yours. My eyes are not blinded by a pride like my sons were. Join me and take Frieza's place at my side as the supreme ruler of the universe. Not a chance. Very well. If you won't join me, I'll destroy you. Huh, try me. Zap! Dust. Huh! Alright, now my work is done. Revert back to normal. I'm just flying up in here like a boss. I'm heading off to a place near here to meet Goku. Would you guys like to come? Weird. How does he know my, about my father? Just follow me. Here, I put a random flight circle so you can follow. And... Let's go. <laughs> I was just going to give it a pause. I was thinking about going back, but never mind. I could level up later. Everybody's here. Yay. Really, Vegeta? Really? 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 Did you... Ow. I don't know who he is, but he's no Super Saiyan. I sure wouldn't want to fight this guy. There's a difference between bravery and stupidity. At least so far, it seems like he's on our side. I guess we'd better follow this guy. I don't know if we can trust him, but we have to We have to if we want to find out what's going on. Gosh, Gohan. This sure is mysterious. Who is this guy, and how does he know Goku? 
There's something about this new guy that seems familiar. I just can't put my finger on it. it, it oh, sorry. I, I wonder if I know him. Uh-oh, spoiler alert! I'm kidding, I ain't, gonna, I ain't gonna say nothing. I ain't saying anything. Y'all gonna find out later in the game. I'm sure glad that guy showed up and took care of Frieza. To be honest, I was scared of my wits because I'm a I'm a douche. Oh God, please, Lord, don't give me something hard. Oh my God. <clears throat> Get ready, guys. I'm sorry. Watch if you have uh, earbuds or any kind of headphones. Sensitive ears. <clears throat> Do you know what's going on? I sure do. Oh my God. Ow! This guy says he's going to meet Goku. Maybe that means Goku is okay. I don't know how they sound. I know that they're girls that play their voices, so there's nothing I can do about that. Uh, excuse me, mister, but how do you know my dad? Actually, I haven't met your dad before. I just heard about him. Then how do you know that he's going to arrive at this spot? Well, that's... Uh, sorry, I can't say. Why not? I'll tell you, it's because you're up to something. Tell us now, tough guy, who are you? I wish I could say. Sorry. When you defeated Frieza and that other guy, you, you were a Super Saiyan, weren't you? Yes, I was. That's a lie! Kakarot, the one you call Goku, and myself are the only Saiyans left. Kakarot's kid there is half Saiyan, so if you count him, that makes three of us. There is no way that you can have Saiyan blood. Ellipsis. No answer? Huh. It figures. Goku should be arriving any second now. Oh. What was that? Oh, let's let's zoom the camera up. We'll find out. Hey everyone! I'm back! With strange gayish clothes! Yay! Huh, <laughs> just kidding. Hey Dad! Welcome back to Earth, Goku! What the heck happened to Bulma and Yamcha's eyes? Ew. Hey guys, how did you know I was going to be here? This guy told us. I think he might be a fan of yours. He's a mystery man. He knows all about you, Daddy. Huh? But how? He knew the exact time and place of your arrival. That's impossible. We've never met. You must have been track he must have been tracking your ship in outer space or something. Really? Hey, where's Frieza anyway? I sensed he was on his way here, and I tried to get it here as fast as I could. This guy defeated him. He turned into a Super Saiyan and picked him apart. Goku, can I have a word with you? Fly with me. I'm flying. Sorry about all the secrecy, but I really need your word that you won't tell anyone else what I'm about to say. Well, I never had a problem with keeping secrets. <laughs> That's a lie. But sure, you have my word. My name is Trunks. This is going to sound really strange, but I'm not from this time. I traveled here in a time machine from 20 years in the future. Really? From the future? That's incredible! Yes. Vegeta was right. Only he, yourself, and Gohan of Saiyan blood. And I got mine from him. He's my father. What? You're kidding! I'll be born two years from now. Ha <laughs> ha No kidding! Vegeta's gonna be a daddy? Oh. I didn't come here to tell you that. I have to talk to you about something. In three years time, on the morning of May 12th at 12 o'clock a.m., 10 o'clock, I can't read time, I'm sorry, two powerful entities, 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 will show up on, on a Membo, a Membo Island. They have dreadful power even by our standards. They're monsters, Goku. Once they show up, the Earth and everything you know will be gone for good. What's the deal? Are they aliens? No, they're both androids created right here on Earth. Their creator is Dr. Jiro, the mastermind behind the Red Ribbon Army. Do you remember? Yeah, I defeated him! Didn't I? You mean he lived? Thanks to you, dumbass. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Look, I'm sorry to say this, Goku, but I know you're a good person. Letting Dr. Jiro escape was a mistake that will come back to haunt you. He's probably working on those androids as we speak. I'm still not sure where, he is, where his lab is. If I knew, I paid him a visit instead of you. You defeated Frieza in a flash! And yet, from what you're saying, these androids are even stronger than you? They are. 
Hunting me down is one of their favorite hobbies. But it's two against one, so there isn't much I can do besides run. <laughs> Sorry, I'm sick. A little bit. I think. I don't know. What? What about the others? Are they helping you out? Three years from now, the Earth's special forces will be wiped out. I'm all that's left. Piccolo is gone, and without him, the Dragon Balls are gone too. So, there is no chance of reviving anyone using a wish from the Dragon Balls. Wait a second, Trunks. What happened to me? Did they defeat me as well? No. Not too long from now, you're going to catch a new virus that attacks the heart. You won't survive it. You know what that's called? It's called a heart attack or a freaking heart virus. What? What a bummer. Being killed by a stupid virus. I want to fight these androids. I didn't even get a chance to take a, take a crack at them. You're a courageous man, Goku. I'm glad I came here. Here you go. Take this. It's for your health. There's no cure now for the virus, but in my time there is. Take this when you get sick and you'll be fine. You're kidding me! Wow, awesome! And it's purple too? I bet it's grape flavored. I shouldn't be doing this because it changes history, but some history should be changed. And I'm glad because my mother told me I could trust you. Your mother knows me? Who is she? Let me guess. Bulma. Bulma's your mother?! Mori! Mori! Quiet down or they'll hear you. Oh, sorry. Vegeta and Bulma are your parents? Wow, you even look just like them. You got Vegeta's attitude but your mother's looks. I don't remember my dad, so it was really great to meet him. He's a cranky guy, but he's impressive. Whatever you do, don't mention this to them. Otherwise, I may never be bored. Alright. Goku tells his friends about the warning from the future. Except that's all a lie, because it wasn't him. Piccolo did all that. Because he couldn't remember crap, and Piccolo had his ears super big for a reason, because he had a Mechian. And, uh, yeah, he just heard everything, so he already knew what was going on. And so we have three years to train. Whoa, dude, that's hard to wrap your mind around. Say, Kakarot, why don't you explain how you escaped from Namek? Or where you got that ridiculous outfit for the matter? I'll have to save that story for another day, Vegeta. I bet Chi Chi has been frantic waiting for me. Yeah, Dad, let's head home. And as we head home, I think that's where I'm going to leave off for this episode. We'll continue on in the next episode of Legacy of Goku 2, Dragon Ball Z Legacy of Goku 2. So be sure to comment, like, subscribe, and please. Uh, I had something going on there. Uh, 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 Goku, you have anything to say? Hey, Gohan, you can train in the woods south of here if you want. Or go inside the house with me to surprise Chi-Chi. How about we go do that in the next episode, Dad? Anyways, stay awesome, you guys. Peace!